Okay, welcome again to my Susutu consonants um, video. Um, for people who are learning the language, I try by all means to avoid uh, all these uh, many long names um, that we use in linguistics. So, let's begin with this term here. How do we produce the sounds p, p and b? You notice that we put our lips together. That's why it's called labial. The alveolar sound. If you put your tongue on the front, the front part of the roof of your mouth, this is uh, how you'll manage to produce these sounds. The t sound and the t sound and the d sounds. Um, they are all located at the roof of your mouth, but the front part. That's why they are called alveolar. That region has a special name, but I'm not going to go into that right now. And the vela are more in the throat area. If you say pick, it's... um. In the throat area like uh, you know the sound of the um, of the farm animals <laughs> you see there are benefits to living in the farm <laughs> and the sound this is the sound you would make if you got something stuck in your throat well that is as far as I'm going to go with the descriptions or the definitions of those um, terms. I hope you have a wonderful time. Please go ahead and do further research on your own if you'd like to.